Welcome to Buy Spares. In this video, we will show you how to replace the fascia on this electric cooker. Important: Before replacing a part in any electrical appliance, you must ensure it is first disconnected from the mains. The fascia on this cooker has lost all the markings as these are often only painted on and can be damaged by cleaning fluids. It's a good idea to check the new fascia to identify the fixing points that attach the panel and ensure you do not have hidden screws needing removal to release the old fascia. On this cooker, all you need to do is carefully pull off the control knobs and line them up so they go back in the same order. Then remove the two screws and any washers previously hidden by the knobs. The panel should come straight off. However, sometimes old spills can cause this to stick, so be careful when pulling. Now the fascia is released, we can disconnect these indicators by sliding back the insulation and disconnecting the wires. Check if the lens has clips that need to be released to allow it to pass through the fascia. Refit the indicator lenses into the new panel and attach the indicator lamps or wires. Then refit the panel into position and refit the screws and any washers. When refitting the knobs, make sure any spring clips are transferred from the control shafts to the knobs if required. Reconnect the power and test the cooker. For all the spares you need, visit the Buy Spares website.